box six, medium flat rate box full. And I have sorted it into wearable, sell, and crafters. Hey, Bolo Buddies, thanks for watching. Full time reseller. All right, let's get started. That way you guys did not have to watch me untangle for an hour. <laughs> um, I bought this on eBay to sell on eBay. It was a total of 344 pounds. If you'd like to see how I did that, you can go back and check out my earlier videos. I do have a playlist and the video, one video shows me weighing everything, which was incredibly fun for me. And then, um, the one video shows me picking it up. And actually the gal that I ended up buying it from on eBay lived um, a state over from me and she met me so I could pick it up. So this is going to be the crafters items. Everything in here is tangled, broken, or um, you know, in bad condition. But a lot of it could be wearable but I did not want to go any further with this lot. I mean, it is, it got to the point where I was like, I'm not messing with it, it's not worth it. Um, some people love untangling jewelry. I'm not one of them. So I'm happy to pass this on to somebody else. Uh, I have two other from my last two boxes that I showed. I'm gonna mix it with that and make it probably a seven or eight pound crafters lot and I'll just sell that to somebody who does crafts or wants to untangle and see if there's anything good there. I mean, I'm guessing it's just all costume stuff. I didn't see anything that stood out. Plus, I know that the gal I bought it from looked through it all first, so not expecting to find any like amazing things. So this is the stuff that I'm gonna put in small lots or I'm going to sell separately. So I'll kind of show you guys what I got. Um, I have some of these in another bag. So I'm gonna, that I got in another box. So I'm gonna lot all of these together because they're new and just let somebody buy the whole lot. Uh, I think I have about eight of those. This I thought was kind of cool. I mean, it's new in the package. She rocks and it looks like it's a cancer awareness thing and it says strength. I think it's kind of neat. Um, so I think it, it would be a good bread and butter item for my posh closet. This is a scarf thing. I'm not sure why I kept this out because I'm not gonna list this. I'm gonna put this with the wearable items and I'll let somebody else do that. Same with this. This little owl is super cute. Oops, sorry, I thought I, but it's just, it's adjustable. So it's not like an expensive ring or anything like that, but it is cute. Uh, just a pin, I'll put that with my pins and I'll sell it as a lot. I thought this bracelet was kind of cool, but the more I'm thinking of it, I think I'll just let somebody else sell it. I like this ring, it's neat. So I will do a lot of rings and I'm gonna sell the rings separately. This is Viva Beads. Uh, now this is kind of like a bib nex necklace. I don't know, it's kind of, I mean, it's definitely cost to me, but it's kind of cute. I may try to list this just to try to get some of this up in my store. These are beads that women wear when they have children and the kids chew on them. So they're like teething rings and I'm like, Blah. Who knows if it's been chewed on. Here's another one. Uh, this one's called Bella Tuno. So I'm gonna lot those together. I thought that I had one more. Here's another ring. So again, these rings will be sold together. I was thinking I had a necklace. And I wanna say it was in this lot because, look at this ring, isn't that funny? And they've got the size. I mean, they're probably just cheap rings. Now, this was a cool find. I saw this and I'm like, I really think that's a neat looking bracelet. And on the inside, it says, um, I can't remember. I think it's like something dinosaur, dinosaur. Let me see if I can. 
it's dinosaur something. And I looked it up and there's actually decent comps. So I am gonna sell this bracelet separate. It's kind of fun. Uh, this is just a bracelet, but I thought it was kind of neat. I wanna say it's stainless steel, it feels heavy. It's not marked anything. Oh, I don't, maybe it is. Hmm. I can't see what it says. Maybe I'll look up and see what that says. Uh, this is another of that um, LE brand. So I am making a lot of these because I found, that's my third one. I was gonna sell this separate because it's a, a shell but I think I'm just gonna put it in a lot and let somebody else do it. This is kind of cute. Again, I had good intentions. I was like, I'm gonna sell this separate. I'm gonna sell this separate. And I'm, I'm starting to feel like I don't wanna do that. So I will put the pendants and the rings separate. These earrings are kind of cute. Uh, there is a necklace that goes with that. It's right here. Oh, I should have put this in a separate bag because it's one of those like wiry necklaces that gets everything tangled around it. If you guys have ever sorted jewelry, you know what I mean? This is kind of a nice little uh, bracelet that my finger was in front of. So um, I thought about selling this separate. It's kind of cool. But again, I might just throw it in a lot. It's a... Uh, let me see what it says here. I can't read it. Tanjore. I don't know what that is. This bracelet's kind of cool. It's still got the original tag. It says Jasper Small. Um, I don't know. Here's another magnet necklace. Here's another one of those uh, wire wrapped bracelets. So I may just add this stuff to the stuff that I'm gonna let somebody else buy and sell. Pull out some of the rings, list those separately. Okay, here's the other chew necklace. Oh, maybe got earrings stuck to it and these earrings are kind of funky I'll show them to you in a minute but here's another one of those chew necklaces so I'm gonna list those together those three um, here's another one of those uh, this brand I think it's Lenny and something I believe it's direct sales I may just take the charms off um, because the leather is pretty uh, beat up These earrings, I don't know. I just think they're kind of fun, but I don't know if I wanna mess with it. Look how fun they are. They're kind of fun. Oh my goodness. I might have to list those just to see if I can sell them. This is Origami Owl. I'm definitely gonna try to sell that. There's another ring. This is a NFL necklace. I wanna look up this NFL stuff. This is some sort of charm me. I'm just gonna throw that in the lot. I'm just gonna leave that. Here's a little My Little Pony. This is kind of fun. Um, I, I want to say that these beads might be clay or ceramic or something. It's got the little moon. It's kind of cute. A part of me like wants to list it and then a part of me is like, no, just sell it. And if I put all this is like a perfume, a vintage perfume thing. Here's like, oh, that's signed. I need to look that up. Can't tell what it is. Oh, it just says made in the USA. But I think that's vintage. I'll put that with my pins. Um, this is a cute necklace. I thought about listing it by itself. This is kind of neat also. like a feather. But I think I'm just going to throw it in the lot. Oh my gosh. 
I really should list this stuff separately, but I just, I don't want to know. I'll probably change my mind tomorrow and I'll already have it bagged and listed. I think this is um, abalone shell. Um, I might list that. These rings crack me up. I don't know if these are pearls or not. This is like a, a pin. I thought that was kind of cool. There was a blue one. I was going to sell those together. I thought somebody might buy these. They're just Claire's. I mean, they're not probably worth much, but things like that do decent on Tosh. I was thinking about doing this with the earrings, but I don't want to. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm horrible. Now this is a heavy duty necklace right here. I may have to sell this just because I love the color of green that it is. Um, it's just cool. It's chunky and cool. I don't know. It's super heavy. It's really cold too. I don't know. I think I might, I might list that one. But for the most part, I'm throwing all this stuff back in. This is kind of neat. Kind of cool. But I think I'm going to let somebody else do it. Again, lots of just gold tone jewelry. Another decent necklace. Um, there's a little skull. There's a little purple ring. Okay. So, um, there's a couple more bracelets. So and I think I was one of these in another box. It's got the tag on it for 13. So all of this, I was thinking about listing individually. And the more I like looked into it, I'm like, that's going to take a lot of time. So I'm going to add it to this, which was the other stuff that I was planning on throwing in to a wearable lot to sell in bulk. I'll just kind of show you some of the other things. So there's a couple, this is like a seed bead necklace. There's another necklace, some bracelets. Another necklace that's new in the package, but probably nothing big. I don't know what that is. So this is kind of a neat piece. It's got, um, I don't know what it is. So yeah, there's a lot of, this is kind of, you know, it's all costume, all costume. This is really cute. It's a seed bead necklace. I mean, gosh, that would take so much time. This one's kind of heavy. I don't know if that's a vintage clasp or not. Sometimes the stuff that's vintage is actually new. It's just reproduced. So this is a decent... There's a lot of stuff here. This is kind of cool. I don't know what this is. Can't, oh, it's a bracelet. Earrings. They need cleaned up. They're vintage. So, yep. This, this is weird. It's like a really weird. It just like uh, bends all a weird. It's weird. So yeah, I'm going to, I'm going to throw this in there too. I'm going to lot this up and I'm going to sell it as a, a lot. So I'm going to do that now and get it listed. And by the time this video posts, it might be gone and it might not. I'm going to put it on Mercari and cross post it to eBay. Again, this will be more than five pounds. So I will not put it on Poshmark. And there you have it. That's box six. Be sure to check out the description of the video. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.